Well, I mean, like, not like as in we're gonna, like, break the comp weird, but like as in, you know, not tanking, I think, is weird. So, uh, we're, we're fighting Zane Hyde, apparently. And I'm banning? Well, well. Pop the collar, because my MMR is equal to Zane Hyde. What? I'm Diamond 4 at the moment, Zane. Why would this happen? Big what? Big what city? Should we just ban Urel? No, no, no. Urel got her bug fixed, but you know. Just ban everything that Zane Hyde told me was good. Uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. I'm gonna ask for some ban requests, see if anybody wants anything in particular. Wants to get rid of Mount Gannis. I'm down, I'm down. I'm down to Gannis. Gannis Manis. Ban his Johanna. Is it him? Is he online? Is he streaming? And why would he be Diamond 4? I thought he was like Master something something. Actually, he's on my friends list. Yeah, he's Master something something. Master's 1000. But, I mean, let me tell you. I, he wants Death Wings, but, you know, we're going to ban Death Wing. Okay. Sure. Wants to punish people out of position. Uh, Junkrat's a fine lead into that. I think Ariel is available. We got, we got a healer main there, though. Looks like we'll be taking up the tank and slack. So Gary, huh? Gary Barry. This needs me. Oh, he might be too stacked as well. That could cause him to be in the lead for a loopadoo. Wow, all right, so they want some resets, do they? I mean, they are a little... Uh, the Garrosh is good against Diablo. I mean, I guess we'll get rid of the Ariel. Because they have a lot of poke. It would be a good healer for them. So I, I want to do Diablo into these two. I don't want to do Diablo into Garrosh there. But we do kind of need a way to access these two. Hmm. We could perhaps disconnect it. We could do the old Johanna. But again, we're not accessing these two right now. Tough. Tough cookies, huh? Murden? That's an interesting thought to get back there, yeah. I like the Sammy now. Now we don't have to worry about getting to the back as bad, though. Thanks to the Sammy. Now we just need a, a bulwark. We need a big wall for Rainer and his many friends here to feel safe on. So Johanna's the obvious. Let's not be thrown by Garrosh thing. And do win. And Alarak. Yeah, I think we do the Johanna to avoid the Gary throws. And then we have the big stun. Arthas is a cool idea too. I like that idea. He doesn't have the stun though to stop Anduin heal. Which is always a chance in this situation. So we're going to do Johanna to dismount the Garrosh. And try to mess with him. Plus she's not weak to Alarak. But I like your head there too. The army, yeah, the army, and then like, oh, maybe he accidentally throws a ghoul or something like that too, Cot. It's, it's all a possibility. All right, all right. So we can assume one of the plats over there is probably grouped with Zane and not going to play very plat-like. But we have a three stack of diamonds, and hopefully we can punish the other out-of-position diamonds. 
Oh, thanks, Stormhots. Appreciate it. Good luck to you on the Li Ming. I'm curious to see if you'll orb build or if you like getting weird in this day and age. So, to join old monkey in battle. I am always ready. Mm. Ten seconds remain. Just letting my team know that we got to respect the Alarak. We can't go disrespecting him. He is probably the big mystery plot over there. If we were to take a guess. It is a hold... Uh, yeah, yeah, we want to hold our ground because that means that that'll be... Let's just dismount Alarak back there. We can. That's... Okay, they're looking at my Raynor. And we are just trying to manage this kind of Alarak space here. And we're going to watch to see if Alarak tries to mount up. Thank you, my friend. Well, you know what? Muradin, or Mal Malfurion, is hitting a lot of his spells really well. So that's a, a big hit in our direction. I'm just going to use that for shielding while we get an orb. We got a little bit of double rotate going on, which I like. And we played with Phoenix Rise a lot. Let's see if we can get some rotating going. Yep, cooldown reduction. Uh, we're going to use blinds on this team to stop Hanzo when we can, but mostly just to get Gary to throw something bad if possible. And then we want as many shields because the way Malfurion healing works. That'll heal underneath my shield. But also, that means less things that Gary can throw on cooldown, and we'll kind of match his cooldown in that way. So right now, we want to keep rotating, but I'm I'm sort of angling around that way to see if uh, Gary was going to try to rotate a bit too. Alarak's got really good auto attacks, so I'm going to try and block those. Alarak has great auto attacks. They are really solid, and one of the funnest things about learning Alarak is learning that he has really good auto attacks. That'd be my guess, is that Alarak is the is the smurf the way he was mounted and sort of hunting. But he hasn't hit his big cell, so we're just going to keep moving around. And that Hanzo is in a little bit of trouble. Nice little rotate by him. Getting auto-blocked. Body blocked. Okay. We are looking at the camp, sort of, at the moment. All right. Yep, yep, yep. That is great thing to do. While Gary is down. If we can also go back and grab... Let's get that back as well, if possible. Honestly, I don't need any... Any wells. So eyes are on Gary right now, trying to see if he mounts up and tries to go in. That's going to be a decent little interrupt for him. I'm going to hit that to increase damage because Rainer's getting to whale a little bit. We can even pull Gary into lane there. All right, Sammy is in another world, which is fine. I want to do Punish Slow for... I'm going to try to get in Li Ming's face there to decrease the damage of her orb. Alright, now's the time when we bail. And, ooh, that is Rainer going down. Alright, we got some overhealing. Let's see if we can get them to... Invest other directions. 
We're gonna get a pushin' in the top. Yep, I like that. We should probably go get this as well during our downtime. Sammy wants to get a gun. So I'm gonna go here and get loud with Garrosh, my good friend Garrosh. And now I need my good friend Malfurion. Who I think just missed sealed, but that's fine. We're really watching out for that Alarak here. There's a decent collapse on the lane here with Alarak if I can zone him. But man, things went kind of wonky in the back. Catch that orb if we can't. Nice. Let's clear the lane. And call it a day. Nicely done. I'm a little low. Let's jump in. Give other people the clear. I like how forward they want to be. We still have a bit of health on this guy. But they have so much poke. Can I get lucky? No. Cool. Looks like everyone's okay. If I pop out right now, we can actually kill. Nice. If this thing is very mad at me and Li Ming's coming in. Oh, it's mad at me. That's fine. That's fine. Whatever. We got the building. It's fine. It's permanent. Do I still do coaching? Not at the moment, no. My, uh, my fatherhood schedule doesn't quite allow for it at the moment, but I'm always excited to get back to it. I really enjoy getting to coach. And I think if as a catalog of coaches with people like not Zane Hyde or not Paradox... It's, I, I like being the coach with the gentle hand. Sammy, I really like his rotates. I think he's getting us lots of XP, which he is. I, I doubt Malfurion took it. It's kind of hard to... Ooh, that invade is bummerific down there, but I am not in a position to really be a part of this. Now, that isn't done yet, though. And my whole team, can I actually, like, just get in here and, like, just, like, own everyone under the sun and just... Oh, the dragon is coming in. Ah, uh, that tire was close. Sammy has to walk all the way in. All right, I didn't think it was going to last that long, honestly. My bad for clearing mid. I should have been there. We could have won that. Oof. Right? Who would have thunk the dragon? Not like the dragon arrow would have given us a better time. Wait, did we get subdue? Oh my goodness. We, we completed subdue quest. Awesome. Okay. Well, they got a gun. Now they got two guns. Let's make sure Gringer gets out okay. Live in the subdue dream every day. How long do we have on our camp? One minute. Okay, so not the best there. But we do have their wall down. That was pretty obvious that I did this rotate here, but I think it'll work out. Just to, just to see. Over here. <laughs> Control it, and you can pilot the protector. 
That'll be a lot of damage. Now we're watching Alarak. That's gonna hurt a bunch, so we're just gonna... We're gonna fire that as soon as we're free. And see if I can kind of do a loop a -doo. Cool. Ah, nice wiggle. Okay. I'll get on it. You all can keep clearing. They have plenty of health. Oh, they put everything in Johanna. And lucky for me, I survived long enough to actually cast my R. That would have been the toughest part there, is we just didn't get a chance to use the R. So we'll sit back. Here they come. Li Ming's up on my junk rat. We got it, but they, they're going to be able to damage it pretty dramatically. Alright, well that does deny my escape. Alright, let's heal underneath. Eh, don't be, don't be hating. Kind of like it's not going to be rocking, but sort of try to long range siege it. Only 20 seconds. At least we denied them getting it. Alright, enemy team is split. We do have Anduin and Li Ming possibly trying to do this camp here. Hyperion's rocking. I got disengaged. Jeez, no, not again. Get the gun. Oh, from the side. No, okay, well, nope, nope, okay. He should be okay, right? Drop the gun. Okay. <laughs> well, uh, oh well. Looks like they're a little undecided. Which is good. They're gonna push in bottom. Rainer Hearth, which is fine. I think we can keep the fort, no problem. Rainer does need to respect Garrosh's space, though. Uh, I'd like to keep this, but I think it's going down too fast. Yeah, it's going down too fast. Double lightning? Is it a lightning barrage build? Yeah, it's a full lightning build. Huh. Alright, well they did drop their turret right away. Sammy's getting us a top camp. I need to push out bottom. There's a heal camp cooking right now. Sammy will be able to join for that heal camp. Can grab both these orbs and make uh, any poke damage. He deals null and void. Sammy wants to walk in top. They're doing their side camp. Here we go again. 
All right. That's actually pretty decent. Should have ripped it a little earlier. Darn. Get the heal. Good silence. Is that the big kill? Can we take their camp? They're all very dead. C is up. This should cause a collapse in top. That means we get the fort for freezies. All right. Seems like we're kind of catching Garrosh off uh, unstoppable cooldown, which is giving us a lot more opportunities. Probably means his team is initiating more than Garrosh wants to initiate himself. Oh, that wall's not down. I'll think about that later. I'm going to go make sure Raynor gets that done, because Junkrat can always bail. Everything's coming down to our really big stuns. For some reason, my mace sounded awesome there. What, what about it? We're done. We got it. Yep, good call on the junk rat. He wants to get those sweet 20 rip tires. I'm concerned about Li Ming coming from the side, so I'm going to be up here since that's the most dangerous. Cool, there's Li Ming. We're just holding. No one's in range in terms of DPS. So we're going to hold on to the Radiant Shield. Oh, butts. That is a huge whiff. Alarak can do a lot of damage. And we are missing our healer. Uh-oh. <laughs> Gotta respect. Let's grab an orb in middle. Uh, heal camp. I want to grab a well. I mean, Zanehide really respects Junkrat on this map. In particular, Zanehide really favors this camp and knows that Junkrat really makes it difficult for his team to take it. Alright, we are all coming back up. We're waiting on Raynor. Top still isn't going to go down. I love that pressure, but not today. We are just staying active on the map and getting orbs at the moment. My wounds heal. There's Rainer.
My top... Uh, this tire does have enough time, actually. Oh, okay. More dragons. Can I just go and finish this? Of course. Okay. There we go. That's finally done. I'm getting another terminal ready for you. Catapult on the bottom is nice. I almost have a well. Uh oh. There's the big stun. Someone finish everything I started. That's what Plank's tank is like. Oh, wow. We caught him. Ooh. The teleport. Oh, oh dear. That's in tower range. Okay. All right. We're leaving. We're leaving. Uh, yeah, cute, cute, but didn't work. Now I'm not. I'm not going into your business. You can barrage me all you want. Just blinding Li Ming off her thingy. Or mount. Okay. Yep, there's really no reason for anyone but Junkrat to be on that point. I will work in the bottom. Okay, here comes the dragon. Unstoppable. Let's pop a shield to absorb that and not lose health since Malfurion is on the inside. Alright, Raynor wants me to get a sweet stun for him. We can be lazy here and try to see if I can hit a building. Oh, okay, I gotta get out of that. Here comes a tire. I'm sort of in range of the back line, but not truly. I got shield. Well played. Well played to my team. God, he loves Junkrat. Phoenix does play a lot of Junkrat, though. Yeah, he did a great job. Did they just try to kill Johanna there? They tried. But we had Subdue Quest done. <laughs> it did, I mean, in the, really. This isn't exactly a Subdue Quest team. With, what, Garrosh and Alarak being in range of it? So... We got really lucky getting that done, and we really were able to slow down Garrosh a lot, which means he popped his Unstoppable, Indomitable, in situations where otherwise maybe he wouldn't have to get out. Anduin also pulled Garrosh out, so, you know, solo queue, lack of communication there, kind of gave us some edges. And we didn't really give up... A, uh, well, we didn't give away a lot of Li Ming resets, maybe we should say. We listened to our Rainer, and I really liked what Sunmoro cooked up, but Phoenix Rise was willing to be patient, and I think that really, really wins out. Let's see. I assume... So, I, one, I was assuming that there was a ace in the hole going on in the background, which there was. Uh, he did take the new unstable compound for more area and gives you more penetrating rounds, but he didn't grab up Painum Red... Though, maybe he wanted the extra one basic attack range. Oh, okay, with an execute, so... Looks like he was doing auto-attack, no problem there. 
Mirror Image Armor. Not taking Regen, but doing Way of the Blade. I'm just curious to see what Sammy's rocking. So, ended up doing Wind Strider as well, but not grabbing the level 1 heal. I guess with the Malfurion, you can just grab a heal over time and then peace out. Dragon Strike, and this is why I was dodging the late game Dragon Strikes. Hitting a hero with Stormbolt Scatter or basic attacks. Oh, okay, never mind. I thought it was like a Kale Foss sort of thing. The longer you stood in Dragon Strike, the more Dragon Strike cooldown he got. But it was actually completely not tied to that. Stormbow, Scatter Arrow, and basic attacks reduce the cooldown of Dragon Strike. Man with a Light Bomb. I think Dragon Arrow would have definitely been better. Particularly with Garrosh Taunt. Yeah. That's what I'd go with. But I also got targeted a lot in the late game as Johanna. So it worked out pretty well. 